What's going on YouTube? Jeans here. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day today. We are back playing some Pokemon Sword and Shield and ladies and gentlemen, you guys know that we got ourselves another banger of a video. We got ourselves an amazing Moxie Salamence team alongside with Galarian Articuno and Speed Boost Blaziken. So if you guys are hyped, make sure you support the channel by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. And shout out to my boy Will for dropping this team in my Instagram DM. It looks fire. I cannot wait to get after it. But rocking out in our front spot, we got ourselves Moxie Salamence. Been seeing this a little bit more on the meta or on the rank ladder. So cannot wait to show it off. It's got that Lumberry, which is an amazing berry. And then the normal move set of Protect, Iron Tail, Dual Wing Beat, and Out. It's just Pokemon is an absolute beast, especially to get the kill. You get the Moxie Boost, and you could potentially just roll out and sweep the game. Right next to him, we got Galarian. Articuno with the competitive nature and that weakness policy are definitely a Pokemon that can sweep as well if you trigger weakness policy or if competitive get, gets triggered you just G Max and then you roll off from there. Not G Max, you just die max and roll for it because this thing does not have a G Max form. Move set of Freezing Glare, Hurricane, Shadow Ball, and it can set Trick Room slash counter it, which is amazing. We got my face cam, the one and only speed boost Blazekin with that focus ash. We have Blaze Kick and Close Combat, both for stat moves. We have Swords Dance to set up, so that can be dangerous. Another Pokemon that can sweep. Like this team has three Pokemon that can just absolutely sweep teams if we can set them up and then protect as its final move. But Blaziken, I can go into a Sword Stance right off the bat, like first move, and then like we have the Focus Ash, so say somebody hits him, we go down to 1 HP, and then we get the Speed Boost as well, so then we're plus 2 attack, plus 1 speed, as long as no one has like first turn priority, we can just roll out and do big damage with it. Then we got Grimstarl right next to him, and I absolutely love this Grimstarl set right here, we got Prankster, Light Clay, Dual Screens with the Light Screens and Reflect, we got Spirit Break, and then Swagger for those special attackers, we can boost their attack. And confuse them. Bottom left corner, Assault Vest Raichu with that Lightning Rod, which is amazing. We got Fake Out, Volt Switch, Thunderbolt, and Nuzzle for Paralyzers. And then in a final spot, another amazing uh, support mod with Umbreon. It has Inner Focus, so it cannot be faked out, which is huge. That Quick Call for potential first turn priority steals. And then we got Taunt, Snarl for special attack drops, Charm for physical attack drops, and Yawn to put Pokemon to sleep. Guys, if you want to try out this team for yourself, Rental Code is at the bottom of the screen, but let's get after it. Let's hop on to that rank double ladder. Try to get some wins with this team. First battle coming at you guys, and this guy has a very strong team. A very, very strong team to get started. He has the Trick Room alongside with Glacier. He can proc with his policy. He can do all that good stuff. He has Stock Attack for Trick Room. And then he has the Sun Team with the Torkoal Venusaur alongside with Solar Power Charger. So how should I go in this? I kind of want to lead Umbreon here. I feel like Umbreon can just counter up a lot. We can just snarl out. We can do tons of different work. So I'm going to lead the Umbreon. And then I kind of want to lead the Grimstar to set up screen. Just kind of like... Just get after it like that. And then bring Salamence in the back. Because I feel like Salamence is pretty good. And Blaziken or Galarian Articuno? They're my they're my last two options right here. I'm thinking Blaziken just to count up on like Glacier and Venusaur. Because what's Articuno really going to do? Yeah, let's go Blaziken. Let's go Blaziken. Especially a Sashmon. That's pretty good. That is going to be pretty good. And then Salamence will probably beat our Dynamax Pokemon. If we can get them all in there. But I want to lead this Grim Snarl and this Umbreon. Just to start pestering around. Potentially throw out Snarls. Um, and set up my screen so they can't really do too much damage. Then we can just kind of wait this one out and get going from there. Then I can also yawn. I can do a lot of different things. So I'm kind of liking this lead. I'm kind of like liking this lead. Everybody knows, if you guys watch my videos, you guys know I really do like screen Pokemon. So that's why I really saw this team. I was just like, dude, I, I love it. I love it. There's something about a team with a Pokemon with screens. I don't know. I just, I just like it. I just like it a lot. But Venusaur is... And uh, Torkoal is going to get the lead on the combo. So we're just going to set up a light screen. And we're just going to start snarling around here. I think that's the play. I think that's 100% the play. Even though that Torkoal does scare me with the eruption and all that good stuff. I feel like we're fine. I feel like we are going to be fine. I'm just going to go here, snarl. And then I'm just going to set up this light screen. And get rolling from there. Light screen, baby. Yeah, you'll get out of my face. I wonder how much this eruption really is going to do. Because obviously Venusaur is going to go first. Or not first. Well, second. Because my prankster ability is going to pop out here. But I don't think he's going to be able to kill my Umbreon. Do we think he's going to be able to kill my Umbreon in one shot? He might just start boosting special attack, which I can definitely see happen. I can definitely see that happen with Max Oozes. But if I can just like waste out his Dynamax turns, or his, uh, Gigantamax turns with Snarls, I think we can be thriving here. I think we can really be looking good here. Light Screen's going to pop here. Beautiful. Set this one up. Get it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. No need for a Reflex. I'm not even going to go into that. And he's going to drop a Ooze. Yeah. With all that coming all day. And Grimstone should be able to eat up pretty fine. Love you, Grimmy. Love you, buddy. He's, he's pretty much just set on special attack. I don't think I should set up a reflect. Special attack is going to get boosted. But then my boy uh, Umbreon right here is just going to neglect it and put it down. We get it going. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Actually, what's called is probably going to take out my Grimstone. The, uh, the Torkoal with an eruption yet. Yeah. Okay, so Grimstone is going to go down. Umbreon should be thriving here. 
we just doing just dandy. Yeah. Umbreon's doing just fine. We do have quick call too, so hopefully that can proc in and uh, get get rolling here. Uh, do I get do I get Salmon's rolling out here? When we can start boosting our speed. Or do I just get Blaziken? Is Blaziken out speed? I could protect. I could protect the Blaziken this turn. Get the speed boost and roll out from there. That could be deadly. Let me see his speeds. Let me see his speeds. I don't think he outspeeds a. No, he, there's no way he's outspeeding. I don't even think plus one's gonna. He's gonna outspeed. I'm just gonna go into Salamence here. Yeah, I'm just gonna go into Salamence, and I'm gonna Dynamax Salamence right here, right now. Let's get after it. Let's get after it, baby. We got the screens. We're looking pretty good here. We're looking pretty good. I just snarl again. That's 100% the play. And then I'm just gonna Dynamax, and I am going to try to get the speed boost rolling. I'm just gonna try to get this speed boost rolling, baby. Cause he's not setting up trick room, so we can potentially roll out here and do some work. You, just, you don't got anything. You're, you're nothing to me. I'm just gonna keep snarling up on you. And Torkoal, you're done. You're done, so buddy. We got my light screen already set up. I'm liking where we're sitting. I think we're sitting pretty good here. So far, so far. Make a move, dog. I think I think he's a little he's a little like, eh, what am I gonna do here? But I don't think I'm gonna kill him with this uh, max airstream, and then I think he guards next turn. I really do think that's gonna be play, and then I just uh, target the Torkoal. But hopefully Quick Claw can uh, come out here, and we can get the Snarl before the Venusaur does go, so that will neglect a lot of the damage. I would really like that. I would like that a lot. Come on, Quick Claw. Let's get it, baby. An item for a reason. Give it to me. Quick Claw. No, no Quick Claw? What are you doing? What are you doing? You're gonna go after my sound, my joke. Chill on my dude. Chill on my dude. So he's gonna boost back plus one and we're just gonna neglect it again, which is totally fine by me. I'm gonna start speed boosting up. Like I said, I think Venus regards this turn. I really do think Venus regards this turn. Or next turn. Or KO. Him. Oh my god, it doesn't KO. Him. Come on. Come on, man. Come on. Come on. We don't pick up the KO. We we're so close. That would have been a huge moxie boost. But can Snarl actually pick it up? I don't think it will. It does not. It does not. But the thing is, this ain't gonna guard. That's the real question. Is this thing gonna guard this turn? Torkoal's gonna erupt. That's fine. We eat. I'm just gonna go for another Snarl. Just to take out that Venusaur. And then I think I, uh, do I Steel Spike? Do I boost defense or do I boost speed again? It's one or the other. I'd rather boost speed. Kind of get rolling from there. Just make sure we outspeed all these Pokemon. Because Venusaur can, can guard here. But he doesn't. Hopefully, maybe a plus two Umbreon can outspeed that thing. We do not pick up a KO here. Umbreon, outspeed please. His quick call hasn't been working all day. Let's go, baby. Get rolling here. Outspeed, Umbreon. Umbreon does not. He goes for a Vine Lash. He's gonna take out Umbreon here. It's back. Oh, Umbreon eats, yo. I love you, Umbreon. I love you. But he, but Umbreon's gonna die here. Umbreon is gonna die here. But I, I think we're fine. I think we're fine. We have another turn in a Dynamax form. And we still have Blaziken in the back. Umbreon's gonna come out here. Torkoal, of course, avoids it. Burn Jealous is gonna come out here. Dominance eats it up, no problem. Gets a crit though. Gets a crit on him. Not like Burns gonna come out here, but Lumberry is gonna is, is gonna take that away. That's huge. Lumberry takes that away. We can uh hmm. I think we just use our, our Dynamax turn on the other Pokemon. This one's gonna be a close battle. This one's gonna be really, really close. Blaziken's gonna have to come out here. Blaziken does have close combat. That that, that could potentially one hit KO. But I think a Blaze Kick takes out that and Glacier is gonna come out here. If Glacier comes out here, I think I have to go into... I think 100% I have to go into the Moxie Boost over on the Salamence here. I think we go into the Blaze Kick here. And then do we boost defense? Or do we lower attack? I'd say we just boost speed. i said we just boost speed. I think speed's gonna be huge. I mean, Blaze King's gonna get plenty of speed, but... Hmm. We'll get defensive boost. But nah, I'd rather just get the speed boost. I'd rather just get the speed boost. We take out the Torkoal. Glacier should go down here if we if the Blaze Kick lands. Glacier is gonna protect. That's totally fine. Is Torkoal gonna protect? That's the real question. Torkoal does not protect. That's fine. That's totally fine. We get a speed boost. We're gonna get double for Blaze Kick, which is huge. As long as he doesn't have like first hitting priorities, I think we're thriving here. Cause we're gonna get the Moxie boost for plus one attack. Salamence is plus three on speed. Blaze King's about to be plus two on speed. Okay, your boy's rocking out. And I didn't even mention. You guys probably know your boy's wearing a different color hat. How you guys like it? It's like a greenish. I really do like it. I really do like it. I got a couple hats for the holidays. And you guys are going to be seeing a variety of them on the channel. So be prepared. Be prepared. Not just the black hat rolling out anymore. The boy skin's going to take some G Max Vine damage. And gets a boost. Loves it. 
Alright. I, I know Glacier goes down one shot to a blaze game. One shot. Charizard's pop here. We outspeed it. Yo, Glacier's done. Glacier's done. And how do I roll up again? This Charizard's kind of scaring me, though. But I still have my set, and I do not have my sash. Again, Blaze Kicks gotta come out here. Do I do a Wing Beat? Do I out? I think I outrage. I think I outrage over onto. Uh, no, I don't know if I outrage. Maybe just do a Wing Beat over on this thing. Get some stab damage in there. Get it. Let's get rolling here. Get a Salamence. Get it. Take this thing out. Ooh. 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 I need you to take out. Glacier cannot be Sash here. He cannot be Sash here. Just KO him. This thing eats? No way. No way. Yo, we just lost. No way this thing ate that. In the heat? In the heat? No way. Yo, bro, I'm so done. Eat this up, Salamence. Bro, we just lost this game. We just lost. I was trying to miss. No, dude, it connects. Eat it, eat it, eat it. No way neither of them hit. Or KO'd. Probably should have dropped the Outrage. I thought Blaze Kick for sure was taking him out. But yo, GG, great battle. We start off 0 and 1. I was so confident on that Blaze Kick picking up that KO. Like I would have put money on it if it if that was the case. Seriously, I really thought it was, but we ended up losing because of that. That was insane. But still, pretty strong battle coming out from us in that first one. Hopefully, we can get ourselves our first win up against this very strong team in battle number two. This guy has Volcarona, which I absolutely love that Pokemon. Glad to see it getting some more loving on the rank ladder. We got Rollaboom, Regilecki, Metagross, Tokus, and Nihilego. Probably gonna lead that thing. Little rock Pokemon. Um, he's probably just gonna drop a Meteor Beam. I don't get along with that. But how should I lead this? He has a few physical, a few special. I think we just set up some screens rock out pretty good. Uh, I kind of want to lead. I gotta bring Blaze again. Blaze can just uh, rocks out here. Look at Raichu or Umbreon. Raichu can nuzzle up, do all that fancy stuff. Uh, I don't want to go Umbreon again. I kind of want to go same squad. I really am liking this. I really am liking the same squad here. I don't know why. I just, I just like it. I just like it. Oh, uh, yeah. Let's rock out with it. Let's rock out with it. Let's actually show off that Articuno a little bit more in the uh, third battle. But, yeah. I, I don't know. Just just the same squad. Just looking just looking good to me. It's looking good to me right now. We're versing Ash. Catch him. All right. That's fair. That's fine. That's fine. He's going to whoop one us because he's Ash. Catch him. Best Pokemon trainer ever. But, yo. I really wish they would have added, like, Grand Ninja into this game that would have been phenomenal but i cannot wait for the new pokemon or pokemon games that are supposedly coming to the switch which is uh gens one to three fully remastered remake not like rematch not like hd but they're gonna be uh ports over here gen one to three kind of like super mario 3d all stars just for pokemon for gens one to three then i heard gen four full hd remake. that sounds phenomenal but he goes into lego and volcarona so i'm just gonna set up a light screen i'm just gonna snarl pester i think if i just snarl around here we kind of get after it like this. We should be chilling. We should be doing just fine. We should be doing just fine. Quick Claw coming in first, yo. Thank you, Quick Claw. Yes, sir. He's going to withdraw in the hell, yo. Okay, I'm fine with that. He's going to send out so many special attackers. Okay, it's okay. I'm with it. I'm with it all day. I'm with it all day. So he withdraws right off the rip like that. I don't know why. I don't know why. Dude, this dude's a little crazy. Like when you get set up. And we got a nice little snarl out here. Love to see. But you love to see, baby. You love the special attack drops. You love them. So that's huge. So three special attackers, and we have and we and we brought these two. Things quiver dancing. I don't like that one bit. I don't like that one bit. His speed's racing. His special defense is racing, and his special attacks racing. And he's any any he has left there. I don't like that one bit. Not one bit. So so oh, I don't like that one bit. Let me see this thing stats. I think I just gotta keep snarling. I gotta keep snarling. He's gonna boost his speed and his special defense all day. Let's start swaggering it. But you know what? I'm just getting after it like this. If he wants to follow me that. That's totally fine. Uh, do I snarl? Yeah, I'm gonna just keep snarling. I gotta keep pestering this thing. If this thing keeps him for dances, he just outspeeds with a huge defense boost. Yeah, ooh, ee. Mmm. I don't know, man. How is this one gonna work out for us? We're just gonna not let him get off on it. I mean, I was gonna take some damage. I mean, we are gonna get minus two on the special special attack, which is huge. And then I gotta get out of Pokemon. I can take that thing out. We're gonna go here. We're gonna drop that. And then we're gonna drop him again with a Spirit Break. Get him. Get after him. Even though his special defense is going through the roof, 
We have we have some physical attackers. Get it out of here. Keep dropping that thing. I'm not liking it one bit. I'm not liking it one bit. Not a fan. I think I keep doing it till till one of my Pokemon goes down. Yeah, I think we keep doing it till one of my Pokemon goes down. I'll just snarl up again. <laughs> well, I could yawn. I am going to yawn. I am going to yawn. I'm told to go home. There's no way this thing's Dynamax. I might just quit dance again. I'm gonna quit dance again. No follow me's coming out here, so that's fair. I'm gonna be on quick call or something. I want this Yuan to come out. Basil Liam comes out. Umbreon, can you eat? I need you for just one turn. Oh, he double critted. He double critted. What you mean? You double crit me like that? Bro, I, I hate this game. I hate it a lot. I hope you guys know that. He double critted me, man. He double critted me. Oh, man, I had a nice little play set up there. Of course, that happens. That is whack. That is whack. Let's go play Salamence. Let's pick up this stuff. Let's pick up this victory royale. Let's go, boys. We're gonna max that sound. I'm gonna hit that thing with a max finishing. We're gonna start speed boosting. We're gonna start getting after it. I am not playing around anymore. Let's get it. All right, Dynamaxing. We're well, airstream. We're gonna steal stuff. We're getting after you. I just protect you. I think I just protect you. We're just protecting him. Bro, dude, he double crits. I was like, Umbreon. I was like, we both eat. We're chilling. That's it. Like that was. That's what I was saying. We get the special attack drop on him. We put him to sleep. We're fine. We'll be able to roll out with these two. And then he doubles up on me. He doubles up with the crits, man. When he was minus two as well, that was minus two on special attack, and he still double crits and KOs me, which is insane. I don't think he's Dynamax him. No, he's not because he he has the speed boost. Hopefully, Quiver dances. I'd be fine if Quiver dances. That'd be a totally fine play by me, or by him. That'd be just be dandy then. Cause I can double throw one to this, uh, this Toad Kiss, finish it off, and then a Blaze Kick could potentially come out here and put a KO. Is he gonna go for follow me? I'm gonna protect you. I'm not, I'm not dealing with this. I want my Sash. I, I want my Sash. Heat Wave comes out. If he gets a burn, actually we have a Lumberry. That's actually fine by me. If we can get rid of this, uh, Volcarona, I don't you dare get rid of my Lumberry. This is not beautiful. Airstream's gonna come out here. This should, I think, take it out. Yes, sir. Get out my face. Moxie boosting, speed boosting. I'm liking this a lot. He's definitely going for the gleam here. But again, he's minus. He is dropped on the special attack. He's dropped hard. I don't think he's picking up KO anytime soon with it. I thought going to get like a mega crit. Oh, he's going to go for an air song. Sir, let's get after that two kiss now. Speed boost coming out from Blazy. Yes, sir. Love sit. Air slash not happening. Not happening. We're moxie boosting up. Now I can. Real question is, no, he's got to be scope lens. I'm gonna go for my steel spike. Take that thing out. Uh, get a defensive boost. Try to moxie boost up again. He's gonna go Nihilego. Okay. Nihilego is gonna pop. Do I close combat? That's a real question. That's a real question. I'm definitely gonna steel spike. Cause that thing's gonna be sash more than anything. No, I think I just drop a blaze kick on this thing. Not. It's 100% sash. It is 100% sash. Nihilegos are always sash. So, or it's power. Up. I really don't want to drop a close combat yet. I just want to drop a nice little blaze kick here so we can see how that happens. Follow me's gonna come out. That's fine. The Salmon's out. No, Salmon's will not out. Dang it. Blaze kick's gonna come out here. Fine. You're gonna go down. It is steel spike. We're gonna get a defensive boost. And we're gonna go Moxie plus two, which is huge. So I got one more turn here. I do have one more turn with my Salamence. And it really depends what this, uh, what this Nihilego does. He still has a Dynamax, which is kind of scary. What are you going to go for? What are you going to go for, Kind Sir? I hope he goes after my Blaze, going to be honest, because we are still Sash here. I'm going to go for the Meteor Beam. Okay, so he is Power Herb here. And who are you going after? That's a real question. Whom are you going to go after? Please go after my Blaze skin. i have my Moxie Salamence in here a little bit longer. He's gonna go for uh, against my Salamence. He eats, which is dandy. Which is really dandy. So please do not have a first turn priority Pokemon in the back. He doesn't. We should be we should be sitting pretty good here. Metagross. Okay. Metagross is popping here. And I don't know what to do. The Steel Spike take out the Nihiligo all day. Um I think I have to get that defensive boost here. Steel Spike takes him out all day. I think I Sword Dance boost. 
Or do I blaze kill? I think I sword dance here. I really do think I sword dance. The thing is, he outsped me, right? The Nail Lego outsped me, right? No, it didn't. Seal Spike came through first. That's correct, right? I don't think it outsped me. Did the. I, I should remember this. I should remember this. Because this will be game. This is this really determines game here. This really determines game here. I know we're outspeeding Metagross all day. But did Salamence outspeed Nihilego? I totally forget. I honestly forget. I hope he does. He should, right? We're going to Swords Dance here. We're going to get after it. I need my boost. Hopefully he goes after Blaziken. And yeah, Salamence outspeeds. We get a defense boost. Can you go after Blaziken, please? This should KO this thing all day. Yeah, this thing's dead. If he goes after Blaziken, I'm liking where we're sitting here. I really am liking where we're sitting here. If he goes after Blaziken. Actually, no, we should have this one in the bag regardless. Two Blaze Kicks should take out... We should... Actually, I hope he doesn't go after Blaziken. I hope he goes after Salamence. Make a move. We can go for a Hailstorm. Oh my god, it takes off my Sash now. It takes off my Sash. I don't like that one bit. I need to KO him now. It takes off my Sash. No! No! Dude, we're playing pretty good. Just coming down to these little things. Do I need a Blaze Kick to KO this thing? Yeah, I definitely do. We are plus two on the defense board, so maybe, maybe, just maybe, my boy can eat up. Bro, I needed my sash. That would have been huge. Two blaze kicks could have potentially taken this thing out. Speed boost coming out here. Uh, do I blaze kick or do I have this thing buff it again? Uh, we go, we go straight for the blaze kick. We get after it. Blaze kick, yes sir. If we can leave him with a burn, that would be enormous. Let's see how much damage we need. We definitely outspeed. I don't think we're one hit KO. That thing's a beast, and is this thing? Weakness policy. It's a game. No, 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 no. Bruh. He hails Storm. He really hails him. That's game. God dang, man. GG's. GG's. Oh my lord, dude. We're playing pretty solid. We got we gotta get a win in that third and final battle. We gotta get a win in the third and final battle. Our battles are legit coming down to the wire. That last battle was one of the closest battles I have. We legit lost that game to a buffet of a hell. That is insane. But third and final battle, looking for that win. Hopefully we can get it for the Jeans Online Gaming Community, baby. Looking for it for you guys. This guy has two Intimidate Pokemon. I got to bring in my competitive Articuno right off the rip. I think I bring Raichu as well for that Lightning Rod from that Zapdos. I don't like that, so I think I'm gonna do that. Uh, bring them two, and then uh, Salamence. Yeah, oh, let's rock out Salamence. I really do like Salamence here. Uh, we got the Steel Spike for the Grim Snarl. We got the Airstream for the, uh, the what's it called the Roll Boom. That works out just fine. And then final Pokemon is gonna be Blaziken. It's gonna be Blaze. I think Blaze might have to come in here. I do like Blaze. I do like Blaze. Let's get it. Let's roll with that. Which I want like a light clay Pokemon. I gotta lead Articuno. Like there's no like not leading Articuno here. Right? You got two Intimidate Pokemon. I need Articuno up in here. Rolling. And then we have that Lightning Rod. Uh, the Lightning Rod Raichu. Just in case he realizes that. Does not go into an Intimidate Pokemon. And tries to kill my Articuno with his Aptos. I think it's fair. I think, I think we're looking pretty good. But go ahead. Go ahead. Do it. Go ahead. Send them both out. Send them both out. I dare you. Let's see what you got. Aptos and Krypton. See? This is this is, this is why I led the, right, the, led the Lightning Rod. We get this rolling. Um, we got Articuno, just chilling. Um, do I Dynamax it? I don't think I Dynamax it. Go for a Freezing Glare. I have to fake out somebody. I am gonna go for a Freezing Glare on you, and I am gonna fake out you. I think that's cool. Oh, he Dynamax him. He Maximax him. He's maxing his Aptos, okay. Um, is he gonna go for an airstream? I'm guessing probably airstream. I mean, I hope he goes for the max lightning and he forgets about the lightning rod, but chances are no, he's not gonna do that. He's just gonna go after this and then get his intimidate Pokemon out, which, okay, that's fine. I wish I could nuzzle on that thing. I can give it a little bit of nuzzle mode. Big guy's coming out here. Mwah! You're not going this time. Stay home. Can we get a freeze on this thing? Can we get a freeze on it? That'd be huge. He goes for the airstream, yeah. Over onto my Articuno slot. That's fine. We eat. We eat. Dude, if we get a freeze here, that's huge. If we get a freeze here, I would love this game for it. Thing is orbed. 
Fine, freezing guard. Give me a freeze. I never get freezes with this thing. Give it to me. Give it to me. Nope. Obviously. Told you. Nothing. Okay. Um. Could try to set trick him. I could try to set trick him. I, I mean, I guess we'll go for another freezing guard and then we'll start uh, pestering around here. He's gonna uh, nuzzle up on the Grimmy. He gets to play. He gets to play. Light screen's gonna pop. That's fine. Light screen me up. I'm bringing out a physical attacker. He's gonna go for another airstream boost his speed. That's totally fine. Articuno goes down. Okay. We're sitting here. Articuno does go down. Uh, the, the problem is. The problem is. It's gonna be when he's just gonna start swapping with the new boot. But I gotta dynamax my Salamence and roll out. I gotta dynamax my Salamence and roll out after this. Nuzzle comes out. Really? Take that paralyzed boy. Take it. Take it. Alright. Salamence gotta come out here. We gotta dynamax him and. Roll out strong. I think we just start matching speed. We just start throwing airstreams over onto this after the slot. I'm liking that a lot. I could iron tail, but no. We're getting after it. Actually, we are going to do this. Because he is physical attacking. That has no effect, but there's no way this thing's rocking ally switch. Do I nuzzle over here? Because I can see a swap coming in, but then it could be, you know, we're just gonna go. We're just gonna do this. We're just gonna do this. Let's see a swap coming in here. The swap, no, swaps go after, no, it's before, it's before. Oh, I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. Can we get, I'm, I'm, I'm not too sure about this. I think maybe we can, can we get a paralyze on a Zapdos? From a nuzzle, from an electric move? I don't, like, I think there's a chance that we can, but I'm not 100% sure. I'm really not 100% sure. He definitely has to be this all. He's gonna set up, uh, send another max session to my Raichu, probably. No, look at my sound. No, dude, why are you doing so much damage? Why are you doing so much damage? Hey, please tell me. Please tell me why. A little bit too much damage. Aren't you gonna nuzzle? Do we get a paralyze on this thing? We do do damage to it, but I don't think we paralyze it. Yeah, we don't paralyze it. One coming out here. Can we pick up the chaos? That'd be a huge chaos. Of course we do. Of course we do. Of course we don't. And he's gonna take me out, right? He's gonna take me out with a spear break. I don't like this at all. Do we? We do eat. He go. He drops down. I think I have to guard here. I think I do have to guard. I think I guard and I uh. The volt switch. Yeah, I think I have to volt switch. Take out that Zapdos. I think that's but yeah. We guard. We volt switch out. We guard and we volt switch out. We get out a uh, Blaziken. Evil comes out from Zapdos. Blah. Oh no, Lightning Rod sucks that out. Oh, oh no, did he forget about that? And now I'm Volt Switching out, man. And hey, my right was starting to get boosted up. Volt Switch. Oh, get him out of here. Just so I can have that fake out for later. We're going to bring out Blaziken. Start trying to roll off with him. This match is not over yet. Raichu comes back to me, baby. Yes, sir. I love you, Raichu. And I still have another turn with my uh, Salamence. And I'm trying to think, who did he swap out in the beginning? He swapped out. No, he didn't swap out anybody. This was his lead the whole time. He's gonna go for spirit break. Block, get out of my face. My Salamence outspeeds that thing. So that's really, really nice. So I don't have to worry about him going down. Unless this other Pokemon outspeeds a plus one Salamence. Right, we're plus one. No, we're not plus one. And Lando's coming out. I don't like that. I don't like that one bit. Lando's coming out here and he's intimidating. E, dude. No, I knew he had these little stuff or something. So knew it. Little buttery biscuit. I like you one bit. I guess we'll drop a Steel Spike. And then a blaze kick over on this thing. Get it, Lando, you're not out speeding us, are you? He is, isn't he? He is, that's, that, that's bogus. Actually, oh, Grimstar was just setting up a reflect. You're not out speeding us, are you, buddy? Don't do it, don't do me dirty like that. I still spike is coming. I like that. Nope, doing some nice damage. Doing some nice damage, can we get a burn on this thing? Can we get a burn on this, uh, on this Lando? We are gonna go before it. That's nice. Give me a burn. Give me a burn. Give me a burn. Give it to me. No burn. He's gonna drop a rock slide. That's game. We still do have Raichu. I totally forgot about my boy. Totally forgot about my boy Raichu. My Salamence does go down. We still have a fake out with Sheet. I'm just gonna fake out the Lando. And I am going to Swords Dance here. I think I have the Swords Dance, right? And maybe hope the Grimstar gets a Paralyze. I need a Swords Dance here. I need a Swords Dance here. We're gonna fake you out. Hey, yo, you're not allowed to do damage. Swords Dance comes out. Hopefully this Grimstarl gets paralyzed here and cannot do anything. That would be huge. Flinches. 
Highlights just haven't been working for him. Just haven't been doing much. He's gonna go after my Blaze. Blaze eats though, which I really, really like. So we're starting to boost up, which is very, very nice. Speed boost coming out from the Blaze skin. Wish I had my Dynamax. I really do wish I, I had my Dynamax here. I have to drop another Blaze kick. And I have to T-Bolt into you. We're just gonna T-Bolt over here. I do have to drop another Blaze kick and get after you. But I don't like you, Landorus. I'm gonna get out of my face. But we are, what are we, plus one on attack board, I think? Our speed's fine, we're plus one on attack board, but he has a reflect setup, which is pretty, pretty neat. That fake out was big, having that Raichu in the back end. He doesn't have his Dynamax anymore. He just wants to have this KO that thing. Yes, sir. We get a crit! We get a crit! Oh, yes. Yes, please. Yes, please. Yo, can this thing, like, not KO my boys again? Okay. Mm. Okay, so Raichu can take that out one shot. Paralyze coming up big for your boy. Speed boost coming out. I should be able to... I should be able to close this one out, right? I should be able to close this one out. Who you got? Who's your final mon? Not playing around. Yo, Blaziken Sword Dance coming across. This thing's Sash. This thing is Sash, indeed. It is indeed Sash. So in that case, I'm a T Bolt. I'm gonna protect. This thing has Unseen Fist. I cannot protect you. We double up through the Earth Spruce slot. The thing is, I'm out speeding. The thing is, I think I gotta go. I think I gotta make sure this happens. Um, let's go back. I'm not worried about the Grimstone. I think I had to double up in the Urshfu. I think I really had to double up in the Urshfu. Urshfu is a big threat. I have to double up in the Urshfu. All right, cool, cool. That should be game, right? That should be game. He is Sash, like I said. That's fine. That's fine. That is totally fine. I need to double up here. Good thing I did double up in this. Blaziken's defense gonna drop. I don't care if it goes down now. He both gonna come out. Yo, dude, that's game. That is game. I told you. Your boy's getting that victory royale in battle number three. What's called did come up clutch. Right you in the back end for that fake out sword stance setup. And then a big crit coming out against the Lando. Yo, dude, that's GG's, baby. That's GG's. I absolutely love the scene. I really did like the scene. I feel like it, it's pretty simple to play. It's not hard to really learn. And it's just, it just rolls out strong. You got a lot of different options with the Blaze King coming in. You got the Glarian Articuno with the weakness policy and the competitive. And then you also have that Salamence who just rocks out all around. And then Umbreon's easy to play. He's just a Fester Pokemon. Same thing with Raichu. You can just nuzzle up, fake out, and then Grimstone you just set up screens. But GG, we go one and two. Let me grab ourselves a win for this video. I'm glad we got a good set of battles for today's video. I feel like the first two battles weren't really badly played. We just ended up losing. They were pretty close and fun to watch. And then that third battle, we finally got ourselves some win. But shout out to my boy Will for dropping this team. I absolutely loved everything about it. Seriously, it rocked out. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everyone.